Oh. 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 It's a reunion. Oh. Well, I wouldn't call it a reunion. It's just we've been busy, God damn it. Very, very busy. And I've had other people on my pod. You should be yeah. jealous. Mike's I'm very Mike, jealous. Mikey's like, you motherfuckers. <laughs> I'm taking very my boy away from me. I I'm fucking very, hate you. I'm very bitter about uh, seeing other people. I'm so sorry. I mean, yeah, it's I, would, okay. I would love to have more more than anything to have you on as always, but yeah. you're a fucking doctor now. Yeah, Doctor Jesus Christ. Doctor Jesus Christ. That's an that's an interesting doctor name. Wish I got paid like one. Like Jesus Christ or Doctor? I mean, t- you would want to be paid like Jesus Christ. He makes a lot of money. He makes hundreds of millions of dollars every year. Billions no, 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 of no. Dollars hundreds of billions of dollars, brother. Uh, yes. I mean, y- religion I mean, is quite the enterprise. You know, you know, how many, you know how many religions he has. Several. A lot. He's got. He's, he's got even the, part of Mormonism too. He's got Mormonism. He's got Jehovah's <laughs> Witnesses. He's got the. Uh, he's even got some of the Jews. He like the, the he's messianic got some of the Jews. Jews. Yeah, he's got messianic Jews. The Jews. Is that like the uh, the Italian cave Jews? <laughs> the, <laughs> the, the, it. the Italian cave Jews. I've never heard of yeah. Italian cave Jews. It was yeah. like all the different sects of Judaism, and it was like. Uh, <laughs> We're from the Italian cave Jews, and ah. like, like, oh, we're from the anti-Semitic Jews. Oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> Never heard of the anti-Semitic Jew chapter. Oh. Yeah, we're here. Yeah, your hair's gone longer. Look at you. you look like a, really... you look like a fucking lion right now. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I mean, you're, I, you're not even a Leo. You're what are you, fucking Scorpio? Scorpio. Yeah, that's yeah. right. You, 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 and Miranda's birthdays are a day apart. Oh uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah, man. But no, but dude, what's going on? <laughs> Fucking goddamn! It's been uh, so long since I've since we've uh, spoken. Well, yeah. I t- we talked the other day, but through text yeah. and. Uh, but I don't know. I I get I get withdrawals. Okay. Yes. Yes. Very much. <laughs> I gotta send you my uh, homophobic uh, Seinfeld shit posting memes that I steal. <laughs> so. Homophobia? Where? There's no homophobia here. This is YouTube, man. We're we're on YouTube oh. now. Oh, uh, of course. Yes. Yeah. Um, very yeah. PC. Yes, absolutely. Very PC. Yeah, man. Fucking. God damn. I don't know what to tell you. I'm just, uh, just been busy as shit to, as always, too, man. You know, like, how's, uh, how's the new gig? Good. Yeah, second day so far. I was, um, uh, I was with AmeriLife for, for a good bit. Is that a new fucking cat? New kitten we just got today. Oh, uh, hello, kitty. Hi. Mr. I'm, Archie, I'm your, uh, I'm your, I'm your, I'm your uncle, I'm your uncle, Uncle Scotty. Uncle Scotty. Yeah. What, what, what's, uh, what, what's, what's, uh, his, her name is, is Archie. Archie. I made the mistake because I didn't. They were there was these two females together, mm-hmm. and one of them was really chill, and we mm-hmm. were gonna get, but I didn't want to separate them because it says they were bonded at the Humane Society. Is Archie racist like Archie Bunker? Oh, uh, he'll be my cat. So yes, <laughs> he's a god. Within an hour of having him home, he was jumping all over the place. Oh, clawed me like ten times. He's uh, he's got a lot of energy. I think he might be part Bengal. Oh, or he could be horny. It could be that. Hey, well, he, no, he's fixed. He's fixed. That that, that fixes all that. How he's fucking there. how fucking dare you? I if if you if you and Katie have kids, are you gonna circumcise your kids? Yes, of course. Good. I I don't know. For some reason, I don't know. It's I one mean, thing like, Jay's got right. He's a, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Like I know a lot of people that you'd be surprised that that would say, "Oh, I will never circumcise my son." I'm like, why? Do you want him to get fucking bullied? Do you want you want some unclean kids? Exactly. Yeah, yeah you want some yeah. fucking stinky dick. And smegma kids, dude. I I fucking I'm a new job. I'm selling catheters. So like, yeah, literally. Oh, oh god. No, I'm I'm training with 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 one of the with the sales manager, and literally, I'm I'm hearing over the phone like, yeah, this this guy who's like 78 years old. He's just like, how does it feel that you get to talk about dicks all day? And I'm literally just like, Jesus fucking Christ, like, like how how am I gonna work this job without busting out laughing? Dicks and old vaginas. It's yeah. A- yeah, it's it's funny. Well, he even he even said like, should I uh, 
Like, should I um um uh trim up a little bit downstairs? And then uh then my boss was like, uh, you know, you could. I mean, that they have a pretty good adhesive that that with um with a remover that won't you know hurt you too bad. And the guy yeah. says, yeah, I got a lot of hair down there. And I'm like, Jesus Christ, it's like Mike Zohan Bush. <laughs> Mike Zohan Bush. If uh, a live he, demonstration of how to uh, place a catheter. I, I would love to do that. I mean, I'm sure you've probably put on several since you've been. No, you haven't. Not at the facility I work at. We don't do anything that goes into the body because I'm not a C. I'm a med tech technically right now. So I'm not a CNA. Well, I am a CNA. I'm not employed as a CNA. So what do you do exactly? You med tech. So you, you like give people their drugs I, and, and hope, hope, hope they die. I'm basically a drug dealer. Yes. For fuck, dude. Fair. Fuck. Yeah. Very cranky old people, dude. I love that. That is so fucking awesome. You're like, it's like I need my. You say like, I need. Uh, I need this. No, you're gonna have fentanyl. Oh, okay. They are all fucking like that. They are all fucking addicts. They are all pill heads. Will you please give me my morphine, motherfucker? One lady takes morphine, but if she's out of her medication, she's very um, ornery. Uh, some lady, because when they go out with their family and stuff yeah. like that, they. The new rule is that we give them X amount of their medication that they're supposed to take over the course of the however long they're going to be gone. Yeah. The correct and whatnot. Um, one lady had it all used up in a day. Oh, my God. Trying to come back to get more. <laughs> uh, no. Oh, fuck. Did I just catch a fly? Oh, no, it did not. I thought cause there's a fly flying around my office. Grass and... uh, I thought I thought I caught a fly for a second. I'm like, damn, it's fucking impressive right there. Oh hey, do you like my new uh, mixer? How how clear do you hear me right now? Very clear. Yeah, this thing's fucking badass. Very very clear. Yeah, I got a yeah, I got like a shore microphone. Yeah, I I don't know which one it is, but it's pretty fucking good. I mean, clearly it's a it's like a condenser mic or no, is it condenser or? Dy- I think it's dynamic actually. Uh yeah, those short ones are good. Surely, the short ones are good. Yes, I mean, I, I've been ta- I've been saying that for years, but everyone's like, I get like... told that every day. So. <laughs> um. Oh yeah. Speaking of short ones, so the catheters that that I'm trying to sell fit all sizes. Hey. I mean, unless if you have like I mean, a unless you have like a buried like a buried dick or something with like that's like covered in like fat and foreskin, <laughs> <laughs> then you're kind of screwed. Foreskin. Foreskin. So new apartment, eh? You moved. You, you've been there for what, like a month now. Uh, pretty much, yeah. Oh yeah, man. How, how you liking it? I think it's literally. I think yesterday was a month. Ah, oh, okay. Fuck yeah, dude. Um, is it in Sarasota? Where you at? Yeah, it's right off of I seventy five. It's the first exit in Sarasota. Oh, fuck yeah, man. Hopefully, yeah. hopefully we can hopefully we can come down very soon and, uh, and and check your place out. I know I uh oh never mind it's over because the uh, the what the, what you call it? the uh, oh the uh, re- Renaissance uh, the yeah Renaissance shit yeah <clears throat> I would love to go there and fucking be un- be uncircumcised and uh... <laughs> circumcised <and> <laughs> no what if like you fucking go there and like you automatically come uncircumcised oh and go back to the medieval times yeah yeah. Have you ever been to the Holy Land experience in Orlando? Do they still have that? <clears throat> I, oh, I've never even heard of that. Really? It's, it, 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 people go there and dress like Jews and stuff. and uh, oh, They dress like Jews? Well, not like Jews. I mean, like they, they go there. I mean, everyone there is Jewish. I mean, because they're, oh. all, they're, because they're all prophets from like, you know, the fucking Old Testament. So like you, you, you can hang, you can hang out with like, I yeah. mean, you know, what's really funny. You know how like Noah is in the Bible? You know Noah wasn't even like a Jew either. He's a prophet of the Jews. He he wasn't even a prophet. He's just a guy who built a boat. Oh, you know that's Abraham. A- a- Abraham was Abraham is the Jew. The Jews. He's the Jew. Yeah. He is the Jew. Fucking Kanye hates him. He hates Abraham. He hate. I mean, I, I can't hate Abraham. Well, I mean, I don't know. You you. I don't know. Can you? Can we hate Abraham? I don't want to hate Abraham. Yes. I mean, he's got the name, and then again, I really don't eat ham that much because he's got the name yeah. Ham in his name. I had ham for Thanksgiving. Ham oh, you did. Oh, you did. One of the Thanksgiving foods, yeah. Oh, I had. Uh, I. I've, I don't know. I've always my parents always did turkey and ham. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I'm getting really tired of of fucking white people turkey. What do you mean? 
I dry white people oh. turkey. You know, I mean, don't get me wrong. I love my aunt's cooking. She's she's a great cook. But yeah, dude, I I had I had black people turkey one time from 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 a it wasn't a black people Thanksgiving, but Michael Chad Thason, let me fucking tell you, man, holy shit, it was so good. Best turkey I've ever had, ever. It was deep fried and fucking they they put some fucking uh, seasoning saying, on fried it. Fried turkey, fried turkey is very. It's uh... it's, it's it's Chad. Yeah, it's very it's, Chad. The, it's the Chad of all turkeys. However, I did tell my old man. I said, dude, instead of Thanksgiving, instead of like we do like t- turkey next year for Thanksgiving, let's do fucking like brisket. And and my dad's like, that's actually not a bad idea. <laughs> I'm getting not... so tired of turkey, man. Like I, yeah. I, I'm tired of being, I'm tired of being tired after fucking eating meal, but after eating a big fucking Thanksgiving dinner because like I don't know, nothing relieving in that. There's just, like there turkey is overly full. I like, I like that feeling of being overly full. It takes me back to my super morbid obese days. <laughs> <laughs> super morbid obese days. I, th- those are good times. I ain't good. So, I really, I, I really wish we were like still connected at the time uh, when when we both were super morbidly obese, so we can just go and eat oh, fucking tri- triple triple baconators every all the time and shit. Oh god, watch me throw up from eating a uh, Asiago chicken sandwich. <laughs> oh, well, I actually, you know what? I did have Wendy's the other day because I, I don't know. I just I just wanted Wendy's, all right. And I uh, got a Dave's double and I put avocados on it. Damn, I don't, didn't even know they did that. Yeah, don't do it. I uh, I mean I, I love avocado. avocado. And what the fuck is this? I sorry. I, I I fucking I came out of the closet, Mike. I'm vegan now. I'm just oh, kidding. <laughs> I know. I I love avocados and I love Dave's doubles. So I was like, wait a minute. What if I fucking put an avocado on a Dave's double? Do you think Dave would be mad? No, he wouldn't be mad. He'd be like, oh, it's finger looking good, you know. So. Yeah. No, oh, he's uh, he'd be very upset. Dave Thomas would be very upset. And that's so funny. I like how his name is Dave Thomas. Fucking Harlan Sanders. Colonel Sanders' name is Harlan Sanders. That's a cool name. And then what? What's the fucking like the founder of uh, of fucking McDonald's name? Oh, uh, Roy Kroc. Is it Roy Kroc? He wasn't. Um, well, he was the one who expanded it. Oh. I mean, I think any retard could have came up with the idea of McDonald's. Fucking. Oh, they were already selling like hamburgers and fries. And Dude, they were shit. selling hamburgers and fries at fucking like Fenway Park. Like back yeah. in like 1880. <laughs> and that could have been McDonald's right there, dude. I mean, come on. Fenway. I don't know. I mean, Fenway or Wrigley or fucking y- Yankee Stadium. Classic baseball stadiums. Yes. I love baseball. You you don't like baseball, do you? I I do. It's way more fun to play than it is to watch. Oh, 100 percent I wanna fucking do softball. I would love to get back into doing softball again. That was a lot of fun. Yeah. I can see you being I can see you being really good at right now. <laughs> I no, I can see you being really good at like slow pitch softball. Join uh, Artie Lang's yeah. beer league. It's your God. Dude, the movie's fucking great. <laughs> I actually, I've never seen that. Really? Holy shit! Yeah, we got we got to watch that together. Uh, some beer league. We should we should do like a fucking like a movie a movie a review slash commentary of beer league. See, here's where Artie Lang plays a dumb drunk. Here's where Artie Lang plays another dumb drunk, and then another dumb drunk, and then oh, I was just watching his fucking uh, this is not happening uh, stand up not too long ago where he fucking talks about the time where he was a pig. And he, goes to, and, he goes to, <laughs> and he goes to buy cocaine and he said the fucking guy who was selling him cocaine was just like, what the fuck was that? Good God. Artie Lang. Uh, he's told that uh, in my Howard Stern watching the old clips of Howard Stern. He, that, I've heard that story talked about plenty of times. Yeah. I was just, I was watching another uh, Howard Stern clip of Artie and Yucko the Clown going at it with uh with some roast. He's like, I fucking hate you, Artie, you fat piece of shit. While Artie Lang is literally eating like chili. While he's, just, he's just getting yelled at by Yucko the Clown. What happened to Yucko the Clown? Do you, do you know, you know what? I just I just looked it up. He's still Yucko. Just he does like fucking like bar gigs now and shit. Oh. Well, he made Brickleberry. Like, he, he did. Was the, he was the creator of Brickleberry. No, that was Daniel Tosh. 
Dave Natasha was on it, but I th- I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure Yucko the uh, Yucko the Clown was. I th- I'm pretty sure that was one of his. I don't believe you. I think Daniel I, Tosh is the creator of of Brickleberry. God, Daniel Tosh. Right. That show was funny, but Daniel Tosh is really like annoying. He's coming down to St. Pete, actually. Some Tosh point oh live. Yeah, one of my uh, well, not Tosh point oh. It's just him doing a show. Actually, a buddy of mine who I met um a couple months ago is, is opening for him. Lit. And his name is as actually Chad as well too. Oh. Yeah, it's very Chad. It's very, it's super Chad. Like the fucking, oh yeah, I keep forgetting about the super Chad meme of the guy fucking with the. No, speaking but, of speaking of that, get, actually, I worked with a guy at a mirror life who looked like the super. The, is it super Chad or Giga Chad? Giga Chad. Giga Chad. Thank you. Yeah, I thought it was super Chad for a second. Yeah, he had like the same like hair, the same like the same fucking chin. Like it was very protruding, like very like almost like crimson chin. Uh, what well, what the what what was the Crimson Chins all um name before um alter ego? Oh, uh, isn't it like is wasn't it like Charles Charles yeah. Charles, Charles Branton Indigo or something like that? Yeah, Charles Char- Hampton Indigo. Maybe? Hampton Indigo. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, <laughs> very. Yeah, it it kind of just looked like uh yeah it was just very square cleft. Very Jay Leno. Yeah, uh, well Jay Leno was more pointy. Like his nose was his nose, his nose, his his chin was Jewish. His, his very Jewish chin. <laughs> oh my fucking god! Guy's Did... got a chin like a Jew, huh? That guy's got a chin like a Jew. These guys, <laughs> a chew, chew, Jewish. Do you remember that stupid youth group back in Ocala from like, fucking? Oh my god, I can't. Did you go to Osceola? Yeah. Um, I knew a lot of kids that went to Osceola and they, they joined this fucking youth group called Chu, C H U, called Christ Has You. Do you remember that? I that was I I knew about the one that my younger brother was in, the fourteen forty at some church or something. Was, what is it like? What does that mean? Like a f- all fourteen year olds and one forty year old? Yeah. <laughs> fourteen forty. Uh it, they, it's like how many minutes are in a day or something? How many minutes are in a day? Or second or something. It was like oh, fourteen forty. Is it really fourteen? Right, I think it might be hours, in, hours in a week or something. I, I forget what it is, but yeah, it's was... twenty four times seven. How often you should be thinking about God? So, so I, I have to think about God fourteen hundred and forty times. Yes, in a week. I, yeah, I got How? no, I got no time for that. I got, I gotta like, I gotta like fucking masturbate, and then I gotta like, you know, obviously go to work and. Write jokes and then you know masturbate again. Masturbate again and then, you know, my, my Miranda will ask for sex, but I have to go masturbate again. You know, like <laughs> <laughs> that's how it works. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So I can tell. It looks like um your gal's done done a lot of um decorating. Look, that no, actually and- a tapestry she got for my birthday. Oh, As far as the X signs, Cancer and Scorpio. Oh. And this little shit was climbing from it like two times. That, that little shit. Nice. Um, question: How much decorating have you done so far? Not enough. Not enough. Dude, like okay. whole Mikey, too. Mikey, you want to know the only decorating I've done in this fucking apartment? Hmm. Yes. So you got plenty of posters and whatnot. All this. No. Look at all that. I mean that's yeah, that's that's more than I've got done. Yeah, even I fucking put Marty McFly on there, and, and then like maybe a couple more paintings, like my uncle painted me or something like that. Yeah, he he likes to paint. Yeah, we got a few of Katie's paintings up. Oh yeah, we got one of Miranda's paintings up too, but Miranda didn't finish it. But it still looks nice. There's mountains. I helped with the mountains actually. Yeah. And my uncle got mad. He's just like, don't fucking help her. And I'm like, why? I, I think I should. I mean, even though I suck, suck dick at painting, but I mean, I think I got it. Oh, my back. This fucking chair is so uncomfortable. Well, maybe I shouldn't be sitting on a dildo. Let's do it. Go. <laughs> why won't this butt plug come out? Jeez. God damn it. This fucking butt plug. I lost a butt plug in my sphincter again. My. <laughs> One of my uh, my my siblings is weird fucking friends. I was I was in Ocala, 
during Thanksgiving, and um, he bought a butt plug with a squirrel's head at the end of it. And I'm like, are you wearing it right now? He's just like, I bought it. I'm like, are you using it? He's just like, no. And I'm like, then why would you buy it if you're not going to use it? It's I mean, yeah, it's, cool to have. I mean, yeah, it's, it's funny. Bad. I mean, yeah, sure. A squirrel's head on a butt plug. That's really funny. And even though it's funny enough, I have a cousin that hates squirrels as well, too. So oh. I'm like, you should totally like fucking put it in your ass. Pull your pants down. And whenever he comes up, he's just, you're just like, eh. <laughs> <laughs> giggity giggity goo um yeah. what did you guys do for thanksgiving Eat. we went to my no. dad for a little bit on wednesday nice are you and in ocala then, uh no uh, oh yeah ocala. and then we went to jacksonville for four days to uh be with katie's family wait a minute so you mean to tell me that we we're both in ocala at the same time again i believe so god damn it <laughs> We just love Ocala so much that we never we never go. Yeah, I love it so much. I never <laughs> want to go back. No, Ocala's not bad. I mean, like they got like a what, like a new fucking. I think they're building a fucking cheesecake factory now, from what I heard, and a Bucky's. Oh, good God. Yeah, I, I, actually, I've never been to a Bucky's before. Neither have I. I don't even I, know what the fuck. I mean, they're just big fucking. Um, gas stations with a fucking squirrel at the end of it oh so i'm bringing it back to the butt plug (laughs) yeah that's fucking fun (laughs) um what ocala needs is a chick-fil-a on the east side of town oof man so mayor whatever the fuck his name is the kkk member oh fucking uh what's his name Ken Gwynn? Ken Gwynn. Yeah. Fucking Grand Wizard Gwynn. Fucking put a it's... Chick-fil-A. You, you mean, I mean, if you're in the KKK, you hate the gays, fucking just put a fucking K- uh, yeah. KFC. I, was, I said KFC. Uh, Chick-fil-A on the east side of town. It's, uh, God, the Lord's Chicken. The, do, you, do you really like KFC? I, I'm a fan of KFC. Uh. I get, I think they, they took the one that was in the shores out. It's just a Taco Bell now. Yeah, it was a KFC and Taco Bell. The Mexicans yeah. won. The Mexicans won. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, I don't know. Like this KFC, just to me, like I feel like when I when I bite into it, I feel like I'm biting like butter. You know. I don't know. It's it's uh. You gotta get the right stuff. It's gotta be made at the right time. Yeah. KFC side is really good too. I I like Popeyes better, but if I had to choose chicken, Lee's all the way, baby. Oh yeah, Lee's Lee's extremely underrated in the chicken meta. Yeah, I'm in the chicken meta. Oh my god, I love that. That's fucking awesome. And I'm not just saying I love Lee's because one of my good buddies is like partial owner of of, of the two franchises in Ocala, but Lee's is oh. fucking good. Good old Lee's. Yeah, I like them because I, they're I not. Have- I haven't had these in years. Yeah, they're not greasy, which is why I like them. Pretty affordable. I like their fucking like chicken plates. I didn't get it. Publix. I gotta I gotta fucking go with Publix too, man. I think Publix is very fucking good. Publix deli chicken is very underrated. Fuck yeah, dude. I um actually do not eat from what I heard from one of my best buddies, he said don't eat the the the, the Nashville hot chicken that they have now. Oh. You got food poisoning from eating them. From KFC? No, from Publix. Oh. Nashville hot chicken? I got the Nashville hot all the time at KFC. <laughs> I When I ate KFC, I was a KFC snacker guy. I always got the little chicken sandwiches. Yeah. Those, those are fucking bomb. Uh, but yeah, my, yeah, G, uh, my buddy said, uh, yeah, do not do not eat the Nashville hot chicken from, from Publix. He started like puking his brains out and shitting all over the place. And I'm like, damn, that sounds like fucking fun. I want to do that. Sounds like a blast. It's literally a blast. <laughs> a blast. A br- um, a bl- what's your go-to sub when you go to Publix? Italian sub. Boar's Head or Publix? Uh, Boar's Head. Yeah, you got to go to the Boar's Head. Are you, still, are you eating meat again or are you still vegan? Um, Sometimes. Uh, very rarely, but I will. Yes! We can fucking eat together and be fucking gross. <laughs> Most of the time I eat meat, it's seafood. Oh, okay. Makes sense. 
So I guess you could say I'm a pescatarian. No, I th- isn't pescatarian where they don't eat beef? I think so. So you mean to tell me you're kosher? Uh, the only meat you eat is fish, as Katie tells me. Oh, is it fish? Oh, okay. Thank you, Katie. We got we got our we we got our Facebook fact checker over here. <laughs> Independent fact checker. Independent fact checkers. Elon Musk needs to go. Are you on Twitter? Oh, I am not. I'm considering coming back now that Elon Musk owns it. I I I'm back. I, I my old account. I can't get back on my old account, but I have I I do have one that I made like a while ago that I was just looking at. You know, just looking at porn on. So uh, then I was just like, <laughs> fucking. I'm just gonna like I don't know. Just do my whole. Put my whole comedy shtick on there too, because why not? And Twitter blue, like Twitter blue, you can pay like eight bucks, eight bucks a month to be verified, but they can also like boost your fucking like your content to like other people. So pretty much what I've been, I'm not, I'm not verified yet or anything, but pretty much what I've been doing, I've just been like just shit posting people on yeah. there. And I've been backing up Cal Rittenhouse way too much actually, because because pe- <laughs> people still think people still think he's he fucking murdered black people, which is like the worst, which is horrible. I'm like, why do you still? Th- do you we not watch the fucking the- trial? I, yeah. No, they didn't. They go with whatever headlines that CNN put out. But yeah, exactly. Yeah, and I'm like, bro. I mean, like, like we talked about this like fucking dozens of times. Like, you know, I didn't know what to expect. I thought he, I thought he fucking thought what I just said. But clearly, after watching the trial and watching a lot of videos, he did not do any of that. No. And these people are still people. These people still fucking are, you know, saying this 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 awful shit to him. And I'm well, like, people also think that men can get pregnant nowadays. So, but Mike, Mike, they I, can though. Oh, apparently they can. Half of the American public would have you believe that. Yes. <laughs> kind of like the old um, saying: "Victory is determined by the victors." Did um, Did you see the fucking uh, the 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 trans woman in, in like New Hampshire? Actually, I did a video on this person. Uh. Fucking, it's a, it's a big fat like Vietnamese guy. Fucking won a uh, a uh, a uh, beauty pageant. Oh, and mind you, you know I love you, Miranda. I love you to death. But the girls that he was competing with were hot, <laughs> and and I'm sure there were most of them were overage as well too. So I'm allowed to say it. And but yeah, he won. He literally looks like if you and I were combined into a fucking Asian woman. Geez, in the Northeast, wow, well, that's yeah, surprising. like you would think. And then, and then, uh, yeah, and then, uh, all these, uh, you know, about the Dylan Mulvaney person <laughs> you seem to see on like TikTok and Instagram and shit, yeah, where fucking they, it, they went, no, he it's... went and spoke to talk to Joe Biden. No, sorry, I'm a little sidetracked. A kitten just jumped on my sack. No, oh, <laughs> wait, Katie or kitten? No, a kitten. <laughs> I was just like, oh, good luck. No, oh, Katie's new obsession is grabbing my nipples. Oh, uh, I am. Um, okay, so I am very against anybody touching my nipples. You know, Miranda has to ask to touch my nipples. <laughs> I, Mikey, I had so many titty twisters growing up when I was a kid. Oh man. God! And, <laughs> and dude, like, I, I won't be surprised if I develop breast cancer. That's... <laughs> like, 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 would That's... it be? Would it be fucking like? Okay. If I had, ca- had breast cancer and I beat it, would it be powerful or would it be embarrassing? It would be embarrassing. Be Very stunning and brave. Do you think? I don't know, man. I mean, like, obviously, the save the tatas and the fucking pink ribbon, that's for women. I would be like, yo, just get rid of them, please. <laughs> I, I, I might just get a double mastectomy or something. <laughs> just cut them both off. I don't care. I would love to, man. I actually might want my sister had an ex boyfriend who had uh, a double mastectomy because he had like the he had like bitch tits. Oh, this is a fucking... yeah. oh, hey Miranda, <laughs> and Miranda just goes bitch tits, and bitch tits. Yeah, no, I he had like little bitch tits, and, and his grandparents were like rich to get his his bitch tits removed. And I'm like, God damn it, I want to get rid of my bitch tits. I want to get fashion way. It's a uh... what was that, Mike? I want to get rid of mine the old fashioned way. So. Uh oh. Uh, I, I also don't work out, so that's counterproductive. <laughs> I don't work out either. I would love to again, but I I don't know. Just like I, I'll be like, dude, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that, but then when I do it, I'm just like, I really don't want to do this. You know, our apartment has two gyms, so I really have no excuse. Really? It, uh, does your apartment have a racquetball court? It does not. It has a golf simulator, though. What, dude? Yes. I am coming down. I yes. love golf simulators. 
Dude, that's fucking awesome. I just played golf the other day and I actually did not actually did terribly. But I uh, know I did okay. I got a birdie. That's all that matters. It's uh God. I I I think I I mean I, that would be the this would be my time to hone my skill at golf. Hey, like you and I can go golf and then the girls can go fucking do girl stuff, you know, fucking go shop and and do more shopping. I don't know. What what do, what do girls like to do, Mike? Yeah, shop. You yeah, shop, so. shop. I mean, we like to shop too, but we can, but we do other shopping. Oh yes, we uh, we shop we, we shop for flashlights. Yes, <laughs> sex toy. <laughs> yes, <laughs> we're gonna play flashlight tag one day. God. Wait, dude, that'd be really funny. Like that could be a good jackass bit where you're in the dark <laughs> and you have you have to fucking take Viagra. And oh. fucking, you, you got you got to like just beat some, yeah, not beat somebody, but you got to like tag somebody out oh. with a flashlight over their cock. What? Oh yes. Oh, oh. So one of my good buddies, who's a comedian named Tom Hannafy, he's like seventy two years old. Fucking love this yeah. guy. He, he has a song that he plays whenever he does stand up called uh, Vi- Viagra. And, oh. it go, and it goes like this. I got to drink off my Viagra because my girlfriend, she said no. <laughs> that's that's a quick recipe for a heart attack. Yeah. And he's dude, he's fucking legendary. I, I love this guy. He's uh, actually funny enough. One of my good buddies, uh, he uh, he gave him um, it, Tom gave him um, a Viagra. And he's only like oh. my, my buddy's only like forty seven, and I'm and I'm like you don't need Viagra. What are you doing? He's just like he just offered it to me. I'm like, don't you need a prescribed Viagra? Um, Viagra can, drug deals. You can get it off Hims. Well, I know they have like the blue chew. You know, fucking like, I hear J- Joey Diaz talks about it all the time. He's like, I got the blue chew. Listen, Every, yeah, listen everyone, mother, ever. listen, cocksuckers. Fucking podcast advertises Blue Chew now. Dude, hopefully I'll get advertised. Hopefully I'll get fucking uh, advertised by Blue Chew. That'd be awesome. Like I don't need it. Like I really don't need it. But why not? I can totally go for an extra fucking boost. Doesn't hurt every now and then. Have you ever taken Viagra before? I took. Uh, what's the other one? Cialis. Cialis. Yeah. <laughs> I have a joke I wrote about Cialis, but I think it's like really tacky. Let's hear it. Okay. Um. So the guy who created Cialis one day was uh, working on the his, a new product in his basement. He kept on trying and trying. He couldn't just he just couldn't figure it out. He's trying to find a new uh, formula to come up with to get bigger boners. So one day he figures it out, pops it, pops a huge boner, runs up to his uh, wife's room and he says, "Cialis, it works." Yeah, uh, it's hacky as fuck, but I don't know. I mean, I think like Thanksgiving. It was a uh, yeah. A... I, mean, I, I could have <laughs> no. It's funny, my. My my uncle's my uncle's girlfriend like she's really supportive with my comedy, and I'm yeah. like and she really one time she was just like you need to perform for all of us and I'm like I'll give you guys fucking heart attacks if I do that I don't want to do that. However, Michael, I do have a clean set now that I've been working Uh-oh. on for a while because the Tampa Improv they want me to do clean so I can get fucking work you know so I um yeah. so I'm going to be doing my clean set on Friday at uh, the one thing I told you about and hopefully it goes really well because I can uh I definitely would like uh you know work when it comes to comedy I'm of course no I've already been a paid comic I just you know want like extra stage time and extra fucking you know people to open for and shit yeah you can pretty much work anywhere if you have a clean set oh absolutely yeah that, that's that's how, that's how it goes you know and then I know it sure. sucks because I mean a lot. I've, I've I mean I've like comedian friends that are like, oh yeah, you know, clean sets where it's at. You know, like all these you can't can't be edgy. I'm like, yeah, you can. Of course you can be edgy. You just gotta fucking like just know where to go and uh, know people really. You know. Yeah. Unfortunately, I could see you not being clean. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> what, honey? No, it doesn't. It is no, Mike. Lift up your chin. It's not uh, Headfield. No, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Remember, Mar- Mar- says your beard looks like Headfield's beard. Oh, I'm like, it does because like, because his chin is not, not on the camera, but now. That before though. Do you hear, hear Metallica's new song? 
I have not. It's pretty good, actually. I like it a lot. It's very, it's very old school Metallica sounding, except for Lars's fucking automatic drum kick. <laughs> automatic. He the can't same, play that fast. He's too old. Same every song. Yeah. <laughs> well, shit, Michael. I have we have four minutes left on this fucking thing because uh, I need to upgrade to pro. So we got four more minutes to fucking. The old, the old, uh, the old upgrade message. I thought if, dude, like we've done like, like almost two hour long podcast before on this fucking thing. I don't know. I don't know why it's doing this. Well, Zoom, I mean, I don't know what, what, what kind of a name is Zoom, Mike? You think it's, you think it's Jewish? I'm just kidding. Probably. Z-E-W-M. <laughs> Zoom. Zoom. <laughs> Zoom-ish. <Yes. laughs> <laughs> Oh man, well, dude. I mean, we we can probably begin it now. I mean, it's been a good forty, almost. Oh, it's only been thirty five minutes. Are you shitting me? We we got we got to go to at least almost fucking forty. I mean, well, I got three minutes and twenty five seconds left. So I'm pushing forty. It's a uh... age wise or fucking. Um... Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say we're 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 the same age. I'm, I'm pushing thirty now. So that's, me uh... too. Yeah, I'm. I, I we're both. I know. So let's I it. know. Even though Miranda just turned thirty, she's fucking old. Yes, <laughs> and Catherine's thirty-three, so she's uh, whoa. She's a uh, my old lady. You know how you know you know who was also thirty-three, who is also very prominent. Mm. Jesus. Oh, he was. I thought he was twenty-seven. No. <laughs> Or no, that was that <laughs> dude, was... that'd be so funny. What if Jesus did die at twenty seven, and like, like everyone else, fucking, I don't know, like Lane, no, Lane Staley did not die at twenty seven. Uh, Kurt Cobain and fucking Jimmy, they all died at twenty seven too. It's just like Jesus was part of the twenty seven club. I think Lane Staley was like thirty six. Yeah, he wasn't very old. No. Yeah. Oh, what do you think of the fucking Pantera reunion? Haven't heard anything about it. I oh, heard that. It- it was announced. I heard that it was coming out, but I haven't like. Bro, seen all it. it is, it's fucking just it's Phil Phil and Summo and Rex Brown with Zach Wild and the drummer from Anthrax, Charlie Benante. It's oh, not yeah. it's not Pantera. It's just a fucking tribute. I mean, yeah. it's gonna be cool though. I mean, I would like That's to. Cool to, though, you know they they can uh, you know all the old Pantera fans can you know go. You kind of look like Dimebag right, right now with the hair and beard. A little bit. Yeah, all you gotta do is just dye it red and die. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm shot on stage. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Miranda said you look like the cowardly lion. <laughs> Mike. His name is Mike, not the cowardly lion. <laughs> yeah, the cowardly lion. You never seen Wizard of Oz? Yeah. <laughs> Mike's like, I've oh, seen... bother. Oh. I've, seen... I've seen it way too many times for a heterosexual man. Yeah. Oh, bother. <laughs> oh bother that's the symbol of judah the lion <laughs> wait is that wait, oh bother the way that's not fucking the cowardly that's lion the that's, that's winnie the, the pooh <laughs> that's the fucking fucking stupid bear that's a fucking bear the fucking bear all right well we got a minute left mike I fucking love you dude like i i am we got to do this again love you too bro every every fucking every week every week Yes, and then even I'm even even when, we're, even when we're hanging out in public, we gotta fucking uh do it. We gotta do Zoom over no podcast over Zoom when we're hanging out in public together. Of course. Yes, and we gotta do it for forty minutes. All right. I do forty minutes. That's cut off. All right, brother. You take care. All right. And you as well. Yes, sir. See you next week. It's fucking cheat time, baby. Never realized how much I enjoyed warm liquid shooting up my ass. <laughs> what? Because I used to be black. And then I voted for Trump and I turned into a piece of Polish Jew. <laughs> and my penis got smaller. <laughs> Three out of five hours, I only eat pussy. <laughs> no, 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 I'm being serious. Actually, no, here's the thing. See, my girlfriend is part Chinese. So she goes to Hollywood and finds cats for me and she kills them and cooks them.
anybody dabble with some cocaine before? <laughs> this is before Bridgie. You can tell me. You can tell me. It's okay. It's okay for all the notes here. Anybody done up cocaine to the point where they shit their pants? I have. Not kidding. <laughs>